called Step to College. And it's like you're in college, you're like real college. It's a long waiting list for the class. If we don't fill the seat that we're in, someone else will, so we better handle what we need to handle to be in that seat. The way I was going before, I'd probably be kicked out of school by now. I'm from Oakland, like you might hear the dominant narrative of our community as being infested with drugs, homicides, death of black young people. There were people selling pills, there was people selling coke. My choice was because I was getting lower grades and I was getting involved in different things that was not me. That's when I was enrolled in Jeff's program and from then like my grades skyrocketed. We're gonna flip the script. Let's give the less privilege an opportunity. I remember Jeff telling us if you're in this program, you will go to college. And we did. <laughs> All of us did. Jeff told us, you're going to be in your life the rest of your life. Kind of like a mother would be. He actually like gave us his phone number. Like if you ever need, you know, help with anything. If the readings for the night are difficult. Like when he gave out his phone, I was like, well, my teacher just gave me his phone number. Like <laughs> We had never experienced that community and family feeling that they gave to the students and how they included the parents. He started going to class, he started doing his homework, and I'm like, wow. So, so Jeff got influence on you. Yeah, mom, he's cool. That's what this program brings out of kids, is who they really are. It allows them to be the students that they really want to be. We could graduate through high school, even graduate college, and he'll still be there. I never had a teacher like that. We've got a developer, we've got a finance person. We're actually looking at land so that we can build the school that our community deserves. Our graduates and our community members will be our teachers. One of the reasons why I've gravitated towards being an educator, of course, people like Jeff, who were able to show me that there, you know, there is an alternative and the role that learning can play in helping us to think about you know, what was wrong with our community, and I think the responsibility that we had to improve that. It would mean so much to the community. It would help so much. I feel like we really need this. We would have a lot more students that are willing to go to school, willing to take that time to learn. And that's what Jeff did for my son, and he turned out great, <laughs> if I would say so myself. Without him, I wouldn't be who I am today. Um, and that's one of the reasons why I've donated backpacks, paper pens, spring books for them right now, and six laptops for the program. That's what we need to do for our community. My sense of self, how I define my sense of self going to college, was always, what's my duty? And that's when he made me realize that it wasn't just for me, it was for my community. I'll be operating camera, be editing this project. No, this is my way of actually giving back. You can't fulfill yourself unless you, uh, to me, unless you're fulfilling someone else. Whether that takes the form of them being a teacher themselves. I see myself becoming a doctor. The more you know, the more you owe. We're not doing this for free. We're doing this for freedom. We need more programs like Steps to College, not just in one school. We need that across the city, across the state, and we need across the United States, across the country.